Greetings and well met family, friends, and subscribers. And today we are going for a bike ride. Yes, up to my parents. Uh, I have to install their new phone system. And since I didn't get to take you up out to the Laramie County Fair, I thought, well, why not give you a look around Cheyenne? Now, this is going to be bumpy in places because the road is pretty bad. So, please bear with me. I'm about to get on the greenway, so the road's going to get better. I usually play music, but YouTube being what it is, they would really have a fit because I play all sorts of music. So, just crossed Crow Creek, the creek that's behind my place. Winds out of the north today. Yeah, pretty wild. Not normal. The wind has not been normal all year. Oops. That is the refinery in Cheyenne. Uh, yes, I live right next to a refinery. Sometimes it can get a little smelly, but it's east of me, so unless the wind is out of the east and they're doing something smelly, I don't notice it. I'm so lucky. Cheyenne has a pretty good greenway system. It's not perfect, but it's close. And I do keep adding to it. Hopefully you can hear me over the wind noise. Just passed some flags in front of the uh, office building for the refinery and yep they're blowing straight out of the north and I'm going north yippee all right first stoplight fortunately there's a button I have to use my monocular to see when the uh, walk light, when it turns green, and the walk light shows the little person walking. Now I have to wait again. And I've got the green light. Still on Greenway. One more street to cross, but there's a light. And I still have a squeak in my front wheel. It's a lot better than it was. I think it's related to loose spokes. So we'll check that again tonight. I hope I'm not being too chatty. And got the green light. About ready to go over the 
Logan Avenue Viaduct in Cheyenne. When I first moved to the south side, this was a little two-lane death trap of a overpass with a very narrow sidewalk. When they rebuilt it, oh, I don't know when, uh, it's now four lane and they knew Greenway was going to connect to it, so they put a Greenway path, sidewalk. Yeah. <laughs> Before I got my e bike, I used to have to stop two or three times going up this hill. I never did push. I just stopped and caught my breath. Kept on going. All right. Crossing the railroad tracks. Now the whole reason Cheyenne is here is because of the railroad. And the only reason the railroad's here is because of one water, Crow Creek, and two, something called the gangplank, which is a very, how do I put that? It's a very low, the grade up to the summit, yes, between Cheyenne and Laramie isn't that bad, so trains could make it without having to do switchbacks or anything else silly. Alright. I know my camera view is pretty bad. I'm planning on possibly getting a better mount in the near future. We'll just have to wait and see. I figured there'd be a few people on the greenway. It is a nice August day after being kind of foul for like two days, three days. I'm sorry I didn't get you out to county fair. Uh, I worked the fair what, last Saturday, Sunday, Monday, and Tuesday. Tuesday I ate something at the fair that didn't agree with me. And Tuesday night, Wednesday morning till about noon, uh, let's put it this way, I spent a lot of time in the bathroom. Okay, first tunnel. This is under a really big intersection. And this tunnel really helped. And we're going to stop here for a minute so I can show you a big boy engine. This is the big boy 4004, one of 25. Uh, static display here in Frontier or here in Holiday Park, Cheyenne, Wyoming, just off of Old 30. This is the 4004. There were 25 of these beasts made, and Cheyenne right now is the only place that has a uh, one that functions under its own power. So, sorry about that. I didn't want to mess up your shot. Yeah. So, if you're ever in Cheyenne, 
you can come see a big boy on static display and if you're lucky go to the roundhouse and see the actual functional big boy all right time to go Ugh. Holiday Park is a nice park. You've got basketball, softball, tennis, uh, picnic shelters. It's got a lake with lots of geese and the park is full of squirrels. on two occasions that I am sure of. They ran underneath my bike. Well, it is seven foot long. And I wasn't going that fast. So, I'm off of Greenway now for a little while. head on a swivel, so to speak. Generally, people are pretty good, but every now and then, believe it or not, the most trouble I get are with people in pickup trucks. Yeah. Go figure. We're about ready to transition over to 17th Street and we'll go through downtown Cheyenne. It's in the 80s this afternoon. Decided to wear long pants and wore shorts. I don't expect everybody to watch this video all the way through. When I get home, I'm going to shrink it down to what, 1080 by 720. I think I'm going to break this into at least three videos. Bump. Yeah, I talk to myself when I ride. The joy of riding alone. And... Traffic? No, not traffic. All right, downtown Cheyenne, quiet Sunday afternoon when the uh, when Cheyenne Frontier Days, which is the last full week of July, ends. This town gets real quiet again.
<laughs> so, once uh, I show you the capital, I think I will end part one of this video. Just waiting for it. There it is. Green light. Make sure nobody's going to run the light. Quite a few nice places to eat in downtown Cheyenne. They're trying to revive it, but eh, who knows? And another red light. Ah. All right, you might hear something. Now I'm going to use my right turn signal. Yes, like I said in the last video, I have turn signals now. And we are turning right onto Capitol. Why is it called Capitol? Because the state capital is at the end. stops in downtown Cheyenne, but, you know, most of the time, Cheyenne's pretty quiet. And another stop, and it turned green. Very good. I hate waiting for lights. Problem is, it can't see me. There it goes. <clears throat> and up in front is the wonderful Wyoming State Capitol building. Leaf Dome, which after a hailstorm a mess of years ago, when they repaired it, they then put several layers of a very good clear lacquer over it to keep the uh, dome from peeling again. <laughs> People were out there on the lawn for days afterwards looking for little pieces of gold. I'll give you a better look here in a minute once I clear the trees make sure no one is behind me. And we'll pull over. So, take it off the mount. That is the Wyoming State Capitol. Uh, been in it a few times. And that is the end of part one. So stay tuned for part two.